Meet Jim. Jim's a lot like you. He's got a family, friends, and a job. His job offers him health insurance. It's a benefit he knows is important for him and his family. But it's complicated. Hey Jim, did you know? Health insurance doesn't have to be so confusing. Jim signed up for a good health insurance plan when he was hired. His plan costs $1,000 a month. Jim's employer actually covers most of the cost, but every week $100 is deducted from his paycheck to pay his portion of the cost. When Jim goes to the doctor, the receptionist asks him to pay a small fee for the visit. This is called a copay. Jim pays the same fee every time he or his family goes to the doctor. Thankfully, Jim's visit is just for his annual checkup. <gasps> Checkups, vaccines like the flu shot, and many routine tests are often called well visits, meaning you visit the doctor to stay well. In most cases, these well visits are fully covered by insurance, and Jim won't be charged anything other than his copay. For Jim's wife, well visits include her checkups and tests like mammograms. Today, Jim is sick and visits the doctor. The doctor ran some tests, and the good news is Jim will be okay. A few weeks later, Jim gets a $175 bill for the visit. Here's why. Jim's doctor charges $200 for the office visit and tests, minus the copay Jim paid at the office. Although Jim has insurance, he has to pay this bill out of his pocket. Why? Well, under Jim's plan, his insurance company starts to pay after he has paid a set amount. This is called a deductible. Deductibles can vary by plan, but Jim's is $500. Once Jim has met his deductible, his insurance company starts to pay his medical bills. Deductibles usually reset every year, so Jim will have to pay $500 next year before his insurance starts to pay for his doctor visit. Now some insurance plans have something called coinsurance. Coinsurance is a percentage of the overall bill that is paid by you, or in this case, Jim, even after the deductible has been met. For this example, we'll say Jim's coinsurance is 10%. Jim gets sick and goes to the doctor again. He pays the copay and a few weeks later gets a bill for $17.50. Let's see why. Jim's doctor charges $200 for the office visit and test. Jim paid the $25 copay in the office. He's already met the deductible, so the insurance company is paying the rest of the bill, minus 10% coinsurance. That 10% is $17.50 and is billed for Jim to pay. Jim's plan is a standard type of plan, but there are other types, some with high deductibles and copays. Typically, plans that cost more every month have lower deductibles, and plans that cost less every month have higher deductibles. It's important for you to look at all your options when you're choosing a plan and take into account how often your family might need to visit the doctor. It's also a good idea to know how your plan works so you're not surprised by unexpected bills.